following the protests that rocked some parts of Lagos mainland local government area on Wednesday by traders from Oingo Market over the closure of their shops. The president of the Association of Commodity Market Women and Men of Nigeria, Fola Shalit Numbuojo, who is also the Yaoloja General of Nigeria, has explained the circumstances that led to the closure of the market last Friday. <laughs> On lo she koko o she pataki fun bogo wa o de she pataki fun wa lati mulo gaga bi olon she fi wa sibe bi olori oja. While addressing journalists at Alausa, Ikeja on Wednesday, Tinumbo just said the chairman of the Lagos mainland local government Omolola SN ordered the immediate closure of the market due to the poor state of hygiene in the market. The local government chairman called me and said that she had ordered the immediate closure of the market. She said that the market was too dirty and not appropriate as a place for food items to be consumed by human beings. I also visited the market myself and ordered the traders to immediately commence a sanitation exercise and that the market will not be reopened until the market is properly cleaned. In order not to make the traders suffer much losses, I asked that the traders selling perishable items to continue selling till the end of the day, but that no other traders at all will be allowed to sell from the next day. The traders who protested under the ages of Oingo market traders accused the Yaoloja General of demanding the sum of 5 million naira from them before reopening. It claimed the Yaoloja General refuted and referred to as a common blackmail. She advised all Lagos market traders to make sure that they sanitize their market and also make it clean.